In this video, I'm going to tell you about what might possibly be the best heat pump on the market. And it's actually not necessarily the best heat pump for all applications, but there is one application in which this heat pump absolutely takes the cake. And I'll be going into that later. And if you're tuning in for the first time and are in the market for a heat pump and just starting to do your research, at the end of this video, there'll be a link to another video where I break down heat pumps and what they are in very easy to understand terms. So stay tuned. That video will be auto-suggested at the end of this video, and it's a quick and simple, easy to understand three minute explainer that explains what heat pumps are and how they work. So first off, what is Mitsubishi Intella heat and what makes it different? Now, the Mitsubishi Intella heat is a low ambient heat pump, which means that it heats effectively in heat pump mode, very cold temperatures. Now it is rated down to negative 13 Fahrenheit, which is negative 25 Celsius, which is pretty cold. Now this in and of itself isn't any different from many other low ambient heat pumps on the market. But one of the features that is amazing is that this is a dual fuel system. Now there's another dual fuel heat pump on the market that we love that's manufactured by Daikin. So if you're not already subscribed to the channel, make sure you do so because we talk about that in another video. But right now I'll talk about how this Mitsubishi heat pump sets itself apart in the dual fuel space. Now, if you're unfamiliar with the term dual fuel, there'll also be a link to another video as well at the end of this video that explains the concept of dual fuel systems. But in layman's terms, it's what it sounds like. It's a heat pump that pairs with the furnace and therefore has two types of fuel. By being paired with the furnace, you have backup heat for those extra cold nights when the heat pump won't keep up if it drops below its low ambient rate. So now that you understand the concept, I'll explain what sets the Mitsubishi heat pump apart in the dual fuel space. If you peruse other videos on our channel, you'll find out very quickly that one of our favorite inverter air conditioners and heat pumps is the Daikin Fit. However, there is one minor limit of the Daikin Fit heat pump, and that is that it cannot be paired with any furnace other than a Daikin communicating furnace. Now, the reason this is unfortunate is let's say you just moved into a home that has a brand new furnace, but you'd also like to put in a dual fuel heat pump. Even though the Daikin Fit heat pump is an awesome option, in this instance, you would have to replace your brand new furnace with a Daikin furnace in order to make this happen. And if you're wondering why you'd put in a heat pump when you have a brand new furnace, there's a variety of reasons to do this. One of which could be to insulate yourself from the rising cost of natural gas, which has skyrocketed in recent years. And you can ask anyone in Denver and they will tell you their heating bill this past year more than doubled. But back to my earlier point, this is where the Mitsubishi IntelliHeat shines. The Mitsubishi IntelliHeat can pair with any existing furnace and it is the only communicating system on the market to my knowledge that can do this. This means that you don't have to replace your furnace in order to get the features of a communicating heat pump. And this means if you are in a very cold climate, somewhere in Wisconsin, for example, you would be able to keep your furnace as a backup heat source and run your Mitsubishi IntelliHeat heat pump as your primary heat source, except on the nights when it got very cold and was below its rated ambient range. And on these nights, it's a seamless transition and integration. The heat pump will sense that it is not keeping up and switch over to your backup gas heat furnace and you will be none the wiser. All that you will know is that you are comfortable and that your home is warm. And it's because of this unique feature that I think the Mitsubishi Intella heat heat pump deserves the title of 2023 heat pump of the year for one specific reason. And I know my Daikin sales rep is watching this saying, Howard, what the f because we're a Daikin dealer and prefer Daikin for reasons we touch on in another video. But that doesn't change the fact that this is a very cool product that Mitsubishi has put out. And the reasoning behind my statement is this. Heat pumps are gaining a lot of momentum and increasing popularity in recent years, but unbeknownst to most consumers, most of the heat pumps on the market, and I'm specifically referencing single stage or two stage heat pump systems, for example, are not a good option in most cold heating climates like Colorado, for example. I don't have time to touch on the nuances on why in this particular video, but we touch on them in other videos and it has to do with low ambient ratings and the fact that they are generally not very efficient. And a lot of the legislation that has been passed recently is actually counterproductive and incentivizing people to put in low efficiency heat pumps like the single stage heat pumps I just referenced. The reason I love the Mitsubishi Intella heat heat pump is because if you have an existing furnace that does not need replacement and you are wanting a dual fuel setup because you live in a cold climate like Minnesota, for example, this is an awesome option and fits a very unique but common situation that we as contractors run into on a daily basis. And that is a situation where a customer wants a high efficiency communicating heat pump 
pump or doesn't need their furnace replaced yet because it's only five years old. And this is an excellent option in those situations. That being said, props to Mitsubishi because this is an awesome product. And keep in mind that this video is as of June of 2023 and manufacturers are putting out new technology constantly. So if the Daikin Fit gateway adapter that they have currently for AC only systems was compatible with their Daikin Fit heat pump, then that would make the Daikin Fit heat pump a very close contender and serve the same purpose. The Mitsubishi would still have the Daikin Fit heat pump beat on its low ambient rating. And however, when it's paired with a communicating furnace as backup heat, the Daikin Fit and Daikin Fit heat pump is still my preference if we're switching out the furnace anyways, for the simple reason that the direct communicating integrations between the Daikin Fit heat pump condenser and Daikin furnace or air handler, it maximizes its comfort aspect and is extremely quiet and extremely efficient. Every time we install a Daikin Fit or Daikin Fit heat pump, People absolutely love them for this reason. And the fact of the matter is that the Daikin Fit heat pump keeps up down to four degrees, which covers 99% of the time in Denver at least. And before I go, I wanna give a special shout out and thank you to one of our subscribers, Dave, who actually introduced me to the IntelliHeat and asked my opinion on it. And as a result, it's now a product that we carry and offer to our customers. So thank you for that. And on that note, if you haven't subscribed to the channel already, make sure you do so because we put out weekly content on how you can get the best HVAC for your home and post a comment in the comment section below letting us know what you think. Especially if you have a Mitsubishi IntelliHeat, we would love to hear your feedback and questions. And if you happen to be in the Denver Metro or Colorado Springs area or one of the other markets we service, click the link in the description below to book an appointment with one of our technicians, whether you need service or annual maintenance, because in addition to providing free estimates, we also come out for free for all first time customers. And like I mentioned at the beginning of this video, there's a link to two videos popping up on the screen right now that explain dual fuel systems and also a quick three minute explainer on how heat pump works. Thanks again for tuning in and we will catch you on the next video.